Hey, future. Why did you put on your Christmas list this year? World peace. And an iPhone X, of course. Oh, come on, you two. I know you do not still write lists to Santa. Why not? Because he's not real. <gasps> Everyone over the age of three knows that. I don't know that. Besides, Santa takes many shapes and forms. What do you mean? Here we go again. <laughs> when I was young, I spent a lot of Christmases with my grandparents. One year, my grandparents had just moved into a new house. They put up the Christmas tree just to appease their impatient grandson, who was waiting for Santa Claus to arrive. I danced around the Christmas tree all night, watching Frosty the Snowman, and put out the usual milk and cookies for Santa. I awoke the next morning and sprung out of bed to see what Santa had brought me. I started to cry as there were no presents under the tree. The milk was still full, and no cookies had been eaten. Santa forgot me. My grandparents came out wondering what I was so upset about, and then they realized they forgot to put the presents out. <laughs> so my grandfather ran next door and called into the house pretending to be Santa. Santa told me that he was behind in his deliveries and that he hadn't forgotten me. My grandmother held me while we watched Christmas movies. During this time, my dad, my uncle, and my grandmother are sneaking toys under the tree through the adjacent window. I finally looked over and there were all my toys. Santa hadn't forgotten me. I was close to the age where you didn't believe in Santa anymore. That specific Christmas fueled the magic of Christmas for me for several years to come and even today. Uh -huh, uh -huh. See? See, Daddy Christmas is real. You mean Father Christmas? No, I mean Daddy. Obeyed his laws, were filled to ride by Santa, Santa, Santa Claus. 